This is Jay on L.A., and we're going to talk a little bit about L.A. and a little bit about what's happening around our country. So let's talk about L.A. We have a mayoral race coming up. We have people endorsing everybody, but I'm still waiting to hear some concrete answers on how we're going to work on the homeless situation. What are you going to use for money? How are you going to make it work? How are you going to get them the mental health they need? How are you going to get them the physical health they need to have taken care of? Where are you going to house them? How about some answers? Instead of all this rhetoric, you know, I heard a great thing the other day from a, a senator where he said, you know, we're not Republicans, we're not Democrats, you know, we're red, white, and blue. We're the United States. We should be taking care of our people the same way we should be taking care of our veterans. What's happened with this whole situation of Republicans using the veto power to prove a point, all they did was hurt the, the veterans, the people that are really suffering, just like they did with the first responders in the beginning. So isn't it time everybody just kind of grew up? Maybe it's time to get rid of everybody over 65. And I'm over 65. But everybody in government, get out. Let's put some young, smart, forward-thinking people in and let's try and change the way we do business. Having said that, let's talk about Pelosi and Taiwan. A lot of stuff out there in the news right now saying she's wrong, she's going to get us all killed. Look, China's looking at Taiwan the way Russia looked at Ukraine. And look at what a pathetic response the United States had to helping the people of Ukraine. Now, am I about war? Absolutely not. Am I about having strategic alliances that make everybody safe? It's checks and balances. And you know what? If Taiwan goes, we're all in big trouble. That's a strategic island for the United States. And the truth of the matter is, we do need to protect it. And how dare Xi, the president of a communist country, threaten the aircraft Tell our president, you play with fire, you get burned. And where's Joe? Hey, the guy threatened you. The guy threatened our country. I want to know what happens if they shoot down Pelosi's plane. What's going to happen if they form an attack? What are we going to do? Are we going to be that paper tiger that they've always called us? Or are we going to actually respond? Joe? It's going to all be up to you, because rumor has it, Pelosi's going. If she doesn't go, we're screwed, because the world's going to see we back down because you got threatened. And if she goes and something happens, you damn well better be ready to put up a fight. This is Jay on L.A.